My name's Emma Gerard and I'm a professional triathlete. It's not quite my profession, I'd like it to be, but I've just always been into sports, all kinds of different sports, so kind of the, the more you combine together, um, I seem to do better at. You know, I was on a kid's swim team, field hockey, soccer, tennis, I can't really pick the first one. <laughs> I was a college athlete, so I did running and cross-country skiing, and you know, I think the goal of doing triathlons was a good one, so I just started doing them and got hooked, kind of like most people do. I actually uh, got to cover the USA Championships as a photographer and was pretty inspired by that, so uh, that kind of motivated me to try to qualify for the race the following year, and I did. <laughs> I worked for newspapers for four years as a photojournalist and uh, was kind of racing on the side and then was trying to juggle both uh, being a pro triathlete and photographer and it kind of worked but they were both kind of unpredictable schedules a lot of the time so um, but I still really enjoy both of them and try to do as much photography as I can when I'm not racing. I could come up with ideas for stories and stuff just from either my own experience or just being involved in in that world of endurance sports. The thing I enjoy about off-road triathlon is every course is different. Um, I just, you know, really enjoy mountain biking and trail running and the type of training you can do for that. You know, you get to train on your mountain bike as opposed to always being on the road or on a trainer inside. So that's really fun. You know, you get to go out and do these epic rides and it's considered training. Sometimes you're dealing with the heat, other times you're dealing with with the cold, you know, they're just long, long, hard races and the intensity is really hard. And, you know, one thing that's really different about Xterra than uh, road tries is how you're racing with other athletes, because obviously with mountain biking, passing's a lot harder and you can also use the other competitors to your advantage. I was the top amateur at nationals in 2007. And after that, I turned pro and, you know, it's, it's not an easy road. Some people have success overnight, but for me, I improve steadily each year, and um, I think I'm still kind of waiting for that, that big break. But uh, I've had really good races this year and been consistently in the top five, and hopefully we'll be on the podium, or top three soon. I think I'm, you know, one of the least experienced at the moment, and actually one of the youngest, which is actually kind of funny, because I'm 29, which is in a lot of sports, is. Uh, pretty old, but for uh, mountain biking and especially off-road triathlon, um, you know, women seem to be getting better as they're getting older. I wouldn't be doing it if I didn't enjoy getting out and training every day, and that's what I do for fun.